lunch up, y'all. Live here in Egypt. We got food for the famished. He's so rich. Wow. He looks like a pharaoh. He looks like a pharaoh. He looks like a pharaoh. We have walked all the way from Israel. We are hungry and poor. Oh, we are bone dry. Do you like some food, sir? Nom 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 nom. Oh, look, it's a bear. It looks so good. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You have saved us from a bear famine. You are an awesome bear. That's all the food we have for now. Wait, wait! I'm missing a cup! Empty your pockets! What? I have nothing. I just got a teddy That's not a cup. I have nothing. Thief! What have you done? No! What? You take it! 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 Gosh, take him with me! You have proven yourselves to be great followers of our God. By the way, I'm Joseph. Zebediah from Israeli News Team V here, and I'm back with the Brothers of Joseph. Now, you all, uh, last time we met, you all were a little bit down in the dumps. Uh, you look pretty happy right now. Uh, what caused this uh, change of heart? We found out that Joseph is our brother. I mean, the Pharaoh is our brother that was lost. It's all very confusing. Yes. Okay, he was just as the Pharaoh. But he's actually our brother, and he gave us food, so yay! So wait, hold on. Joseph is now the Pharaoh? And he's he our brother! Yeah. He was just as him. He was pretending to be the he's Pharaoh. He was pretending. Oh, oh my gosh. We've been looking for Joseph forever. Man, maybe now we can get our interview with Joseph. Okay, but first of all, I, what happened? Like, uh, last time I heard that you guys threw Joseph in a well, and like... We were, we were mad at his bragging. We had issues about that. I'm what? sorry. Okay. He was went to therapy session. Therapy. Now it's what all good now. now why what made you change your mind about him? We he felt he him became home. rich. He became rich. He got that usually no that he was, he was we were grateful for him because he gave us food even though we were mean to him. Yes. We Family members who would become rich and give you stuff. That usually <laughs> heals all wounds everybody. Yeah. Alright. Um and I yeah. Oh, there's young Ben here, even younger than he Joseph. He almost got arrested. Hey, arrested Ben, what happened? Um, I stole a cup, I guess. No, I didn't steal a cup. He got you planted. Did it. He was planted. planted. With what? A palm tree? Framed. <laughs> framed. No. framed? In what? A picture? No. What happened? By Joseph. 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 Yeah. Joseph. Yeah. Joseph. Yeah. Joseph. Yeah. Joseph. Yeah. 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 And he almost he took him to jail. He oh to my gosh. Prove. He wanted to, to test wow. We still believe in God. That God. seems like an even crazier family <laughs> reunion than my big fat gypsy wedding. So, <laughs> thank you all for your interviews. I'm sure I'll be seeing you soon. Right now, we're going to go try and find Joseph back in the palace. All right. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. This is Zebediah from Israeli News Team V. And we're going to go find Joseph. We found Joseph! We finally found Joseph! Joseph! Hey! Do you remember me, Joseph? Uh, I'm sorry, I can't remember you. I, I'm, I'm Zebediah from Israeli News Team Z, and I, I interviewed you earlier um, seven years ago, um, or, or sometime or like that, and 
I this was before you you became you know all all this. So, but since then I've been trying to track you down, find you. I I went to jail. I went to Potiphar's house. You know that was before you. And then I I met your brothers actually, and oh, it's been a long journey for me. Now what about you? I'm sure it's, you know, just can you tell me uh, what's it been like to go through all this and. Uh, have you, what about you has changed? Well, it was really tough, you know. I thought I had it all. I was having these great dreams. I thought I was going to be, you know, the ruler of everything. And then I was betrayed by my brothers. And that was tough to handle, to be sold into slavery like that. And yeah, I forgot about the slavery part. That's, that's, that's pretty buns. But thankfully, God gave me some gifts, particularly the one to interpret dreams. And through his guidance, I was actually able to use that to its best extent. And I ended up in charge of um, the gardens of, in Potiphar's house in the prison. And eventually, Pharaoh had me interpret his own dreams. And thanks to that, I was able to earn a spot as his right-hand man during these times of famine. And it's been a great experience. And God's really helped me learn that I always need to use his gifts to what he thinks they should be used for instead of being filled with arrogance. Now, there is the whole issue of your brothers uh, pushing in a well, taking your beloved coat, and then selling you into slavery. Um, do you have any bitter feelings or resentments that have held over from that? Well, after they showed their love for Benjamin, I was really able to forgive them. I feel like they have understood the important lessons and that, you know, God, God wants us to forgive. I can't, I can't hold it against them. They're my family, and they just, they were trying to follow their gut. Well, thank you. I finally found Joseph. What an amazing story. You know, hopefully this will get me out of this podank little area of the Middle East, and maybe I can go someplace fabulous like Italy or something. All right. Well, this has been a very exciting. Uh, seven plus years for me uh, get to see Joseph grow up and uh, what happened with the rest of his brothers um, for the last time this is Zebediah from Israeli News Team V and I'll be catching you later Israel